because one of the other issues with mentoring that, that we need to do a better job with is actually better matching the mentor with the child. Some mentors would be very comfortable helping someone with their homework or with their reading or with their math, where when you get into some of the issues revolving around family dysfunction, abuse, alcohol, drug, they may not be as comfortable. So I think we need to capitalize on our ability to kind of better match uh, mentors with our students. That, th that way the return for both is much higher than if you're put into an uncomfortable situation, which is one of the issues uh, that mentors face and mentoring as a movement faces. The ability to not only re attract mentors, but retain them over time. And one of the keys for young people is consistency over time. So if I'm here today and gone two months from now, I haven't really done much. In fact, it reinforces the perception from the child's view that I can't count on anybody. You're with me for a year, two years, you build the bond, you build the trust, that shows that young person, yes, there is somebody out there that I can trust that will be there for me. Just a powerful message.